So I'm back over at that storage place. I'm gonna see if uh, this is the one that Dan won for, uh, but we're gonna see if there's anything to buy. Uh, and we're gonna go through his boxes. Hopefully if there's something good, we'll find out. Um, he just got here, so. Anything good yet, Dan? Ooh, cast iron. Let's see, is it a good one? Actually, that's a shot. I can see a name on it. Uh, it's a Dutchy oven. Well, hopefully I find something to buy. What are those? Oh, hinges. I wonder if they're brass or they're probably steel, right? You have a magnet. So, there'll be a lot of that today. We're going to go through a bunch of boxes. Um, he's got, you know, a mountain full of stuff. So, hopefully we find something. Anybody know what these crates were for? Please let me know. They're kind of interesting. assortment of stuff mostly soda tops and old baseball kind of dates the room probably all 90s this one's 1984 so hopefully there's some uh, Nintendo or something in here we'll find out So don't take the tops off anymore because they don't come back on easy. Yeah. Isn't there another way to open them up it's like sideways or something? Yeah. Gold! Maybe. Well, take it out of luck. There's jewelry. That would be awesome. This is a heater for a fish tank. That's good. I mean, definitely dollar. I would put most of this shit on here. Alright, just make sure it's able to pack it. There's a gold-plated watch in that bag. That's all I saw. That was... Yeah, somehow, like, this must have been sitting outside or something. There's a bunch of garbage in here that got moldy. I'm sorry, Dan. But these would have been good. Like, they're very sellable if they weren't ruined. I don't know. I found my first thing of the day. It's different. Let's see what's in this guy. Oh, Lion King glass. They all different collectible glasses. I like that thing. That's a little antique. All right, I'm gonna unwrap some of this and see if I find anything else. So I went through that. There was a lot of cut glass. There's a ruby glass vase. This nice big Coke glass. I like this uh, opalescent. Uh, looks like Fenton or something. Mug. 
Uh, but I was happy with that eyedropper. Making my pile. Just thought he was funny. Put him, oh, I don't want to put him with the glasses. Uh, Alright, let's see if we find anything else. Honestly, I'm very impressed right now. This just keeps on giving. It goes all the way back. Uh, full of totes. I don't know if you guys can see that in there. It is pretty impressive. I would say there's got to be uh, three, four hundred totes in here. Definitely. I think I just saw something in this. He's, he's a nice pair of uh, doorknob. But this settling. What do you get on the cutting torch? I don't even know, Dave. You have to look them up. Don't know what that is. It looks almost like something military. So I just found this weight belt and the tips for a gun cleaning kit. This looks like an orange uh, gun butt. So there might be some firearms in here. There's a lot of, this is part for a clock. But I do like that old brass handle. We'll, we'll see what else I find. Nothing, uh, nothing really that great yet, but it's all really good flea market stuff. There's got to be, look, keeps on going. We'll see if we find anything else great. So, just found something interesting. There was a box with a lock on it. Um, ooh. I found he's really beat to hell but I think it still might be okay I'm gonna have to take this box out and go through it first Nintendo game let's see what's in here do you have a hammer we can uh, what do you think is it gonna be heavy or light it's heavy. Oh man. All right, we'll get back to that. All right, so one. I don't know. I have not found any yet. I found one piece so far, Dan. What? How'd you do it? Oh, with the clippers? Oh, you bend the... Don't bend that too much. Oh, You're messing it all up. I want to go back to the Nintendo. Maybe there's more. I didn't... Nope, that was just that one piece. Let's see. See tin foil. Hey, it's a knife collection. That is a lot of knives. Found one that I like. Hey Britt, I'm really good at throwing them. Look at this one. Even has this little uh, corkscrew deer bone handle. The way that was locked, we were thinking it was going to be something, uh, something real special. sharpening stones at the bottom. Alright. 
So, it's just, it's like strainers. I wonder if that's fake coral. Kind of looks real, but it might be fake. That's cool. Nice, huge blue tractor. That was a time my kid used to, would kill for the one of these. Nice Ford. There's a, looks like a ship's lamp or something. At the bottom of that. Let's see if that's for Nintendo or for telephone. So, Dan found a Louis Vuitton bag, but I don't know if it's right or not. It looks pretty good, but I, I'm trying to find a number. It's got nice brass uh, screws on it, but I honestly don't know. Uh, I'll look at it tomorrow. Doesn't look bad. Now, what would you ask for that, Dan? That would go online. Yeah, because it's a couple hundred bucks if it's right. Maybe four or five. Yeah. So, take your time with that. Let's see if it has the number. That was back here. So, room still given. I mean, we didn't go far. We only went from that corner to here. And we've got, you can see how many more totes there are. Dave said he's giving me three dollars a tote. <laughs> but we'll see, uh, see if it's actually worth it. Not just kidding. I'm probably not buying all uh, for three dollars a tote. He can, uh, he can sell them. <laughs> he'll make, he'll make plenty of money. But it, I think there's, let's see. There's 16 right there, so 16, 32, uh, 46 totes so far on the trailer. And there's definitely way more than, there's got to be 300 totes. All right. Uh, I saw this. So it's got the Super Nintendo uh, controller. anything else in here. It might just be the controllers. But it makes you want to look more. Wait, that's a Super Nintendo something. Yep, Nintendo power cord. see what else is in here in a little bit. I don't see any more uh, Nintendo things though. It's all paperwork. Lots and lots of uh, telephone pieces. Mostly garbage. Alright. Uh, this box has something in it. I'm making a weird... Uh, Oh, it's fire trucks. I see a $10 game. It's a Trump game. Somebody will give you 10 bucks for it. All board games. Toy box. What is this? That's that car that flips around. I wonder if that would be cleanable. Home Alone 2. Yeah, 
It's a shame these got so... I might be able to... Doomsday Warrior. Return of the Jedi. Doesn't look like the teeth are messed up. That puts it into... Let's see. This is my pile so far. I've got uh, all those butcher knives. That. The games. And the cords. Not finding it enough to make it worth going through all this stuff. Hope you guys are enjoying it. I'm going to keep on looking. So, so Dan did find oh, some gold. I mean, he is... That's freaking gross. Probably the grossest thing I've ever seen somebody do. Just take him out of somebody else's retainer. But, oh, that is, <laughs> you better be yakking. <laughs> oh, Dan, you should see all the little pieces stuck on here from their tongue. I'm just messing with you. Don't mean to gross you guys out. So, <laughs> He's dying. I uh, wanted to just show you what was left. I still can't believe he put that in his mouth. I'm sorry. <laughs> Whoever's squeamish, please don't uh, hate me for that one. All right, we'll see what else. So that's what he's got on the truck so or trailer so far. What'd you just find? Got his first shot of a musical instrument. Oh, it's a trumpet. Let's see what the brand is. Oh, it's the, I think it's like a student Selmer. Might be good. What's that say? Well, I would say uh, Dan has probably what four or five times this dan in in that locker maybe maybe eight times this in that locker there's a nice pair of antique uh binoculars but uh it'll be interesting what else he finds in there so there's an early pair of jordans He's going to bring it all to the flea market tomorrow and try to sort it. Um, we'll see how he does. So, I ended up buying uh, the box from Dan. I um, thought that skateboard VHS was different. I got everything for uh, $40 plus helping him load that uh, trailer. And it's definitely a good buy. I should make uh, double my money on the knives. So the video game stuff is uh, is a profit. I don't know what this is. Um, it's got a little dinosaur on it. So if anybody knows what that is, let me know. Um, thank you guys very much for uh, watching and uh, and. Thank you for everybody who's shared the videos. Uh, talk to or see everybody next video, and if you haven't yet, please subscribe. Peace.